When you think back on your experiences as a learner, what differentiates the content you still remember today from the mandated curriculum content that you quickly forgot? The key to durable and sustainable learning lies in cognitive activation. When you stimulate learners to think in depth about issues, analyze or discuss them, or put them to use, you are fostering active learning. Which active teaching strategy are you using? What else triggers active learning? Flipped Classroom allows you to flip the usual classroom routine around. Instead of presenting new materials during class, students study the class content on their own before the actual class. By doing so, you free up class time, which can then be used to discuss the topic, answer questions and resolve misconceptions. In case-based problem solving, Students apply their current knowledge to solve a real-world problem together with their peers in a small group. Finally, Think, Pair, Share is an active teaching method with three steps. It enables students to think deeply about a problem and, together with a peer, develop a refined solution. In the first step, students think individually about a solution to the problem posed by the teacher. In the second step, they pair up with their neighbor in class and discuss their ideas. In the third and final step, all pairs share their solution with the whole class. Think Pair Share is best suited when you want to discuss complex issues in depth, when you want to uncover students' existing knowledge on a new topic, when you want to stimulate your students to generate hypotheses, or when you want to recap and expand key lessons in class. With active teaching techniques, you encourage your students to engage in deeper learning. Which active teaching strategy will you use in your next class? <music>